evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and we are back inside Lumber Tycoon 2. What is that? Is that a... That's a tree up there, isn't it? Uh, how far away is that? What, what kind of tree is that? I think that's just birch. That's just birch. It's gotta be birch. No way, is that a... Hold on. Yeah, it's just a birch tree. Okay. Maybe. Yeah, okay, there's other there's other trees. I just saw that silhouette in the background. Okay, no time to waste. I uh, need to get in here and do some things, so let me just stand here for a second. And I need to tell you, um, the participation that you guys had for the No Shave November was amazing. And I'm actually going to show you the analytics of it. Give me just a second. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There we go. Fade, 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 fade right here no shave it's it's that time again to shave here right right here right like like the news person right here is the estimated value of revenue that you guys have generated over the entire course of this time and it was nineteen dollars and nine cents and it happens just like normal like I, I usually predict where really big strong start and then it just it dwindles over time and that's that's given that's what it does and that is okay so I went ahead and I made um, the the donation to the st. Jude's Children's Research Hospital for you guys and like like I said, I went ahead and doubled the amount and I added an additional $10. So you guys not only raised um, $40, but I went ahead and added 10 and gave you $50 for your donation. Um, there was an e-card that was sent to you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and play this now. Um, the artwork and design is by a St. Jude's patient. A gift has been made in your honor for St. Jude's Children Research Hospital. Do, do, do. This gift will help St. Jude continue to find cures for children with cancer and other life-threatening diseases through research and treatment. Your gift was generated by your participation. Simply by watching, you created this gift. Thank you. You are amazing. Code Primates fans. Uh, I, I guess I was supposed to just put Code Primate, but it's it, like it was a little mix-up. Anyhow, this is for you guys. This is like, thank you. This is you generating money off the ad revenue to donate, to give to research and, and for children. That's huge. That is a huge thing. Uh, by the way, the, the original um, thing, it didn't go all the way through. It only let me put in like a certain amount of letters and characters. So the original thing that I wrote was... Your gift was generated by your participation. Simply by watching, you create a gift that will be used to help save someone just like you. No matter how many times or how often I say thank you, it can never express how much it means to me for what you have done. You are amazing. So that was the original. I had to kind of shorten it down a little bit, but seriously, thank you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Because, I mean, that's that's why I do this. Is That's why I shave out my beard, and that's why I shave it off at the end of November. It's so you guys can and come and watch and participate and generate a donation. And it's, it's not pulling money out of nothing. It's not, it, it, it's literally, it's your participation, your, your watching generates this gift each year. So... Okay, enough sentimentals. Oh gosh, we need to fade back over. Fade, 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 fade. Um, oh, uh, I have three confirmations for the Pack South badge winners. Um, Zach, Sky, and Mario. Thank you. I still need to hear back from uh, Khadija and Sebastian. Khadija and Sebastian, I'm going to send you another email tonight. Hopefully, you're going to be around and. Send me an email back and say, hello, how are you, Code? Oh my gosh, you're so amazing. Thank you. And, and then all that stuff is good. But Merry Christmas. Um, I know it's not Christmas because I'm recording this on Christmas. So it's still Christmas for me. And we had a great day of like opening gifts and having food and hanging out and just playing games all day. Like it's, it's amazing. I love the holidays. I love Christmas. I love this time. And um, at five o'clock in the morning, I came in here. And I went ahead and opened up all the balls. <laughs> I wanted the low numbers, and I got some low numbers. Um, so, little cheat on that one, because uh, you guys, seriously, <clears throat> I had to turn my phone off because you were hitting me up like, "Oh my gosh, you gotta get in there and open your presents right now." And I couldn't sleep. I, I literally, I got up at five o'clock this morning, ran in here. Jingle was online. Hey, Jingle, how you doing? Um, <laughs> 
he loaded his base. I'm like, no, no, I just, I'm not staying. But he's like, I gotta show you this. And I'm like, dude, I will see it. I promise. I'm gonna make a video on it. Uh, all right. 48, 23, 48, 39, 48, 29, 48, 12, uh, 48, 07. Hold on, I see another one back there, sneaking around. Uh, 48.58. By the way, if you guys don't know what these numbers are, these are the order in which they're opened on all servers. <clears throat> it's literally like a serial number. There is no other ball in any server that has the same number as you. Even, and this is, this is a big even, even if you take a ball and duplicate it, yeah, I said duplicate, then it will generate a new number. Literally, it's it's like a serial tag number. There, there can be no ball with the same number of any other ball, ever. So, oh gosh, they're all rolling. Uh, 4869, 4823, 4839, what was this one? 48 something, anyhow. Um, I've got to go put these into a bin, otherwise they're gonna go flying off. <gasps> Yay! Look at that, 4848! 48, 48. That one is a high price number. Whenever you have double double digits like that, or whenever you have, um, stuff like that, uh, that, that's a rarity. Like, that, that's a, it's a pattern. <clears throat> 4868 and 4862. So, okay. Uh, this is gonna be my first opening of all the other gifts. I'm just gonna get them lined up here. Uh, this is my first reaction, first everything. I'm so excited! <laughs> oh, come here, duck. Or, I mean, uh, present shaped like a duck. <laughs> <clears throat> and then we need one of these, and we need one of these. Oh my gosh, there was a lot of presents this year. Uh, one of the, oh gosh, uh, one of these, <clears throat> and, uh, oh, one of the big ones back there in the back, but I won't, I won't bring it up here to the front. Okay, and before I do this, uh, I really do, I need to take these and put them into a safe place, which is going to be in a bin, but I want to make sure that I, they're not going to go flying out at the moment during this video. That would be a horrible thing. Okay, hold on. I don't want to walk that entire way. We don't walk anymore. We have pink trucks. That's why we we have trucks for. All right, <clears throat> just get you right up here like that. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, no, no, that's fine. Shut the door. And here we go. Oh, oh. I didn't notice any of the pattern numbers on there. Um. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Good deal. Good, good deal. <clears throat> And if you do have those uh, ball presents, I highly recommend you open them up um, quickly to get your lowest number. Uh, don't keep them in the wrapping. The lower the number, the higher the price. I am missing one. Gingerbread. Oh, there it is. Gingerbread. Come here, buddy. Ooh, bud. There we go. So look how many presents we had this year. Oh my gosh. And the Maniacs on top of it. And Mamazing's um, uh, pink picture. Picture. The Lonely Giraffe. Okay, let's do this first one. All right. And what is it? It's a candy cane. Oh, like we predicted. All right. Does it do anything? Oh my gosh. It's a mesh. It looks amazing. Can we press E on it? Doesn't do anything. Hmm. Okay. We'll have to, uh, it might just be for decoration. It might just be awesomeness. Okay, next up is going to be the trash can lid. Um, prediction is going to be a plate. Oh, look at that. All oh, snap. Oh, and it's a... This is the first cylinder gift. Cylinder box. Okay, let's go ahead and open that up. And it's a plate. It's a very nice plate. Now we can do dining room sets, huh? Huh? Very cool. All right, next up is going to be the hot chocolate with little marshmallows in there. Oh my gosh. Ah. Open it up, open it up. <gasps> Yay. Oh, it's so amazing. Hold on, let's get this up here so I can get a close up of it. There we go. Oh gosh. Look at the, look at the little details of the little marshmallows in there. <gasps> that is awesome. Can we drink, can we drink it? Wait, wait, can I pick it up? 
you know, can't pick it up. Aww. That'd be awesome to walk around with it and be like, you know. Defaultio. Program that. Program it so we can walk around and drink our mugs of uh, hot cocoa. And then um, make me a coffee. <laughs> All right. Uh, here is the duck. Oh, he's a ducky. <laughs> he's a little duck. Um. <laughs> oh, I can think of some machines that we can put to... Oh, does he float in water? I don't know if he floats in water. We're going to have to take one down to the, the water and check to see if he floats. All right, here goes the snowball. Woo! There it is. There it is. Oh, my gosh. It's huge. That's like double the size of coal. Can we press E on it or anything? No. That is awesome. It kind of looks like a meteorite. Like... <laughs> okay. Um, we're going to have to take that up to the volcano. Test it out in the back of the vault. All right. And the purple gift, the plum gift, is to green head. Oh, my gosh. Oh. <laughs> It's like a neon green head. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Is this is this any comparison to the other colors of the uh, the bobbly heads? Because I think we had a, a purple head last year, didn't we? Do, 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 and it came in a green box, right? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't have. I don't have them. No. Where are they? Do, 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 there they are. Oh yeah, yeah. It's it was purple. Look at the bright green. Oh, that is awesome. Uh, by the way, if you didn't know you could do this, um, you can attach these to the back of cars, like that. And uh, they will stabilize you a bit. Whoa. And the... Whoa! The reason it stabilizes is because <clears throat> this has a constant up force. Okay, there's a, there's a force on, oh, come here, come here, stop, stop moving, stop moving, disconnect. <laughs> there is a constant up force. If you've ever tried to lay down a, uh, a wobbly head, you'll notice it always rolls to the right side up. Okay, and so for, for those of you that did not know, the, the object itself is like a weeble wobble, and it can't lay down. What is that? You're not supposed to be able to lay down. Hold on, boink, there it goes. <laughs> Demo fail. It actually laid down. All right, put that in there just for now. Oh, we got more presents to open up. I'm so excited. I'm really excited about this year. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Wee! Come on. Oh, oh, oh. This is going to be like this, this, and this, along with the spork for uh, table sets, are going to be awesome looking. Okay, <clears throat> one of my all time anticipated I once is this one right here. <gasps> the cone! Come here, little buddy! Oh my gosh! Yes! It is a cone. It is a cone from Cone. Oh, look how round and smooth it is. Oh, that is awesome. Traffic cone. For those of you that don't know why I love that one so much, um, hold on, let me. Let me go find the game Cone. I'm going to advertise it here because I, di I didn't do it in the last one. I meant to. Uh, there it is. On Cone by default. Yo, there it is. Okay, so Chrome, open this up, fade this in. Cone. You got to go and play this game. If you've not played it yet, it's it's by defaultio. The name of the game is called Cone, and it is an adventure game that you're gonna have to figure out or go watch my videos, and you can see how to do all of the things. I did a playthrough of all four endings. There's still a fifth ending that I have not done or revealed, um, but there there is another ending that he revealed to me the other um, while back, and that's, uh, yeah. <clears throat> That's all I have to say about that. <laughs> I'll let you guys figure out the rest. Anyhow, that is the cone from Cone. Oh, well, it's one of the cones. It doesn't have the break in the thing. I wish it did. But I was also thinking, what if we did like put it through some conveyor belts and 
made it look like the whole cone era. Uh, maybe did some some wires and stuff. We'll make it look like the corporate business um, that puts the cone things on. Oh, oh, that's gonna be awesome. Last is the gingerbread. <gasps> gingerbread axe. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's so pretty. It's so little. Is that a little axe? Can we pick it up? Hold up. Oh, we can't. <laughs> it's like this. Look at the size. <laughs> Hold up. Can we hit things with it? Come here, oak tree. <laughs> it's like a little treat. It does. It chops. No way. Three chops. One, two. Three. Now I gotta figure out the comparison of like how much damage this thing's actually doing. Don't jump in the back of that coat. You're gonna you're gonna glitch out the ball, man. Um, okay, let's go grab a rookie and a um, in times. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Do 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 do. Just for a second, just for a second, and then we'll go compare the. Uh, let's see, rookie, rookie. Come here, rookie. Thank you. And an in times. Come here, in times. I should be able to go snag it through there, just through the, the little end. Okay, uh, I see. All right, I can see clearly now. The rain is gone. <clears throat> okay. All right, this, this way, this way. Come on, come on, come on. Let's go. All right, got my little gingerbread axe out here. All right, and one, two, three, four. Five. Let's switch over to Rookie. One, two, three, four, five. And end times. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so the Rookie and the end times are the exact same. It looks like there might be an extra little hit. No, it's just, just perception. Exact same damage. So that means that the gingerbread does less damage than the rookie and that but who cares it's a tiny axe it's an itty bitty axe it looks amazing uh we're gonna have to see if it will chop any other kind of trees differently maybe it chops koi trees or maybe electric wood really fast that would be uh that would be awesome to check out but we have one more gift to open one more awesomeness and then we can go try our game theories. <clears throat> Sorry, copyright. Um, then we can go try our um, theories. <laughs> Look how little it is. I love it. Chop, chop as fast as you can. You can't catch me on the gingerbread axe. <clears throat> All right. Get out the big presents. This is the way Christmas is supposed to happen. It's supposed to do the big presents very last. And you guys, oh my gosh, you guys. You have been pinging me all night about the toboggan. You're like, it flies. I don't know that that was an intention, but you can pick it up, right? Right? You're not supposed to. <laughs> Yay. This is not actually flying. This is you picking it up at the same time of, uh, of it supposed to be like, oh gosh. You're not supposed to be able to fly with this. But you can. <laughs> oh, gosh. Hold on. Hold on. What happens if I get in the middle one? There we go. Now, does it do anything? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We're flying. This is awesome. Like I said, it's... I think it is an unintentional um, thing to be able to fly. Uh, he will probably fix this. So, like, if there's anybody sitting on it, you can't grab it or something like that. But as of right now, you can fly with the, the toboggan. What is the... What? <laughs> oh, gosh. So, we, we're going to have to go over to the Iceland. All right, just drop. <clears throat> Boom! And it is slick. I mean, it's. I think the bottom of this thing is made out of ice, or it's got the traction of ice. Because look, it it just slides like crazy. So, if you've built uh, a ramp, get ready for some awesomeness. 
um, okay, okay, wait, wait, wait. We have two things to test on the, um, what is it, on, on the volcano. One thing to test on the, okay, here, let's, uh, let's just drop this in the back. Wait, wait, stay, stay. Will this work? No. This isn't gonna work, is it? Okay, and what what else? I wanted to test the snowball. We're, we are 20 minutes in, and let's go ahead and test the candy cane as well. Okay. So, let's go. We are heading up to the volcano. What happens if you put three of the snowballs together? Does it make a... <gasps> that would be awesome if it if you like can make a um, snowman out of it. Uh, I don't know if there's any kind of hidden scripts or anything. Uh, I've not looked at the source code. I never do. I'm really excited about the, uh, the toboggan, though. That is awesome. <laughs> Defaultio. Isn't it awesome, the bugs that the players find whenever you release something? <laughs> he He's usually upset about it. It's like, oh, man. But, I mean, he's very... Okay, so if you guys don't know, um, Defaultio is extremely intelligent like um but he's also he's introvert uh, so like classic programmer and and classic engineer genius level stuff that he comes up with and thinks um me i am i am very ultra out, like extrovert outrovert no extrovert and just kind of outgoing in, in general oh oh no 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 stop stop come back sled <laughs> oh no keep an eye on it keep an eye on it oh, oh I can't see it I can't see it did it stop oh man okay we'll go get it uh. <laughs> so if you, if you don't know that's that's the story um, so when when things happen like he doesn't really get upset about them it does bug him but in general, he's okay with it. Mm. And he's also, he's not one to like, ban people instantly, he's, he's very forgiving. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> oh my gosh. Oh, okay. We're just gonna leave those there for a second, and we'll come back to them. We'll see if they melt, or uh, if they change in any way. Now let's go get the toboggan. I was, I was worried there for a second. I'm like, no, don't, no. <clears throat> but it's okay. I bet a great place for this would be um, at the little rock bridge. Not the little rock bridge, the, the rock bridge. Skiing down that thing. Of course, uh, the, what's it, um, snow biome. It's also gonna be a great area for this. Uh, and also, I have seen the, the tweets and the photos of you guys going over to the Palm Island. That's great and all. How are you going to get the wood back? <laughs> Everybody's been taking pictures like, look, I'm at the, the palms. I'm like, that's amazing. Now get back with some wood. <laughs> so there's something you don't see every day. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's bust it out. There we go. <clears throat> if I get in the middle one, that should be... A little bit more centered. Let's go forward a little bit. Forward a little. Forward a little. There we go. Woo! Wee! <laughs> awesome! Awesome! And you like you can you can keep going. Okay. There we go. And and. And go! <laughs> Woo! Whoa! <laughs> yes! Yes! That was awesome. <clears throat> now, if I do sit on the, the front end here and I grab, then I should be able to go a little bit faster as far as, as upwards. But again, if the object is re registered as being under your feet, then it forces you to let go. So, it's just gonna be a very slow trip upwards. Keep my angle 
just right. But I should be able to go up the mountain. Uh, what, what can I angle? Can I angle it like that? Maybe? <clears throat> just don't drop. Just don't drop. You'll be fine. Maybe I need to go back this direction. It would have been faster to drive. Just saying. But a lot faster than walking. Not going to lie. And a lot more fun. All right, let's go. Let's see. Since we're over on that side, let's see if the scubus is still there. The flower is still there for the scubus event. So Beesmus is still going on. Whole lot of shaking going on. <clears throat> I don't know if anybody's tobogganed down the volcano yet, but that could be fun. Uh, can I angle this a little bit more? I'm, I'm, I'm risking it by angling it. Uh, there we go. Oh, oh, I dropped it. I dropped it. Okay, fine. You just, just can't get away from the, the original. Oh. The original blue. Ooh. There we go. Oh, no, 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 no. Stop, 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 stop. Wait, can I... Ooh, I can grab other areas too, right? Ooh, oh my goodness. Okay, what happens if I just do this? <laughs> oh, come on, come on. So the the blue is trying to correct where I'm grabbing it at. Whoa. What if I grab back here? <laughs> oh, goodness. What if I grab right here? If we had like three people to grab on. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> grab it by the seat of the britches. Grab it by its seat. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Enough messing around, Code. Can we angle this thing or move it all? We cannot. All right. Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop, 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 stop. Stop, stop. Mm. Okay. There we go. There we go. Whoa, it went backwards because of the camera, where the camera was. The tree got in between the camera and us. Oh, come on. There we go. No, come on. All right, I need to be in the middle chair. And, oh, and off we go. <clears throat> I do like it. it. It has a buoyancy, kind of like the, the wobbly heads. So it forces it to uh, to right side up every time. <clears throat> we're gonna we're gonna go down inside the volcano first. Um, hopefully this is not a, a bad idea, but I'd also like to come down the back side here. And do this one. That would be fun. <clears throat> and we have a, a few few of the toboggans to spare, so that'll be. F oh my gosh, this is this is amazing. All right. Um, this is this is a pretty good angle, right? Hold on. Let's go right here. See if we can slide a little bit. Boom. Oh oh oh! Get over. Get over. There we go. Oh goodness. Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. There we go. Do 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 do. Okay, just just go forward, dude. Just here we go. Here we go. Drop it in. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Go. Okay. Okay. This is this is not working. Okay. Okay. Maybe maybe if we get some uh, some <laughs> some lag going, then I'll come back up here. But that's yeah, that's not happening today. <laughs> 
All right. Here we go. Off the edge. Off the edge and go. Wee. <laughs> okay, I just I fell down. That's it. That's Everybody's like, oh, that wasn't really that cool, dude, dude seriously. <clears throat> you need to find something else to do. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, let's go grab our car. We're at 30 minutes. I do want to check the duck, okay? I, I want to go see if the duck is floatable, if we can throw it in the water, you know, to see what we can do. <clears throat> but the toboggan is very nice. I like the toboggan. We'll see what happens when we get three people on it. Zink. There we go. Oh. What in the world? Get back here. What are you doing? Seriously. Making me look bad. Like I don't know what's going on here. Wow, that is that is super slick. Okay. Let's go take a look. Did it get any smaller? It doesn't look like it got any smaller. And the candy cane looks unaffected. <clears throat> hmm. Hmm. Okay. We'll go compare it to another uh, another ball. <laughs> Just out sledding on Christmas Day having fun. I know for you guys it's the day after Christmas, but that's okay. I'm having fun. Alright, here we go. Going down. Oh, no, no, no! Stop! Oh, dear. Oh, dear, 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 dear. How far is it gonna go? Um... You know, it's okay. We can do this. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Uh, hey. <clears throat> Idea. Don't know if this will work or not. We always get our trucks flipped, right? And now we have something that we can lift. Hold on. Doesn't really work, does it? Hmm. Whoa, 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 whoa. Boink. Lift. Code. Lift. You're not lifting hard enough. Doesn't doesn't really work. Alright. <laughs> okay. Uh let's see. Let's just go ahead and toss these down. And then I will go and regenerate. A new truck because we got we got things to do we got places to go you guys have stuff to do <clears throat> I mean you don't want to waste your entire um, holiday vacation on just watching me open and mess around with this stuff so here we go <clears throat> and I am gonna get a truck I think a truck would be easier to handle Zoink. <clears throat> there we go and reset. Here we go. Your friend, Amazing Gaming, has joined. <gasps> no, it, did she leave? Mummy! Did I miss her? Oh no! And I spelled mummy wrong. Oh darn it. Alright. I'll have to go say hi to her after, after the vid. I did buy more presents. Yay! I knew I had some more in here. And I'm glad it's a cone too. And that little bitty gingerbread. Alright. Uh, making my way. No, I'm just mo mo moving along. <clears throat> taking my time. And I'm taking my time just to moving along. Boink. All right, you get in the back. There we go. Snug as a bug in a rug. And snowball. 
And I will compare it to the uh, other snowball just to see how its size is. Silver bells. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, let's go ahead and grab another snowball. That one's. All right, compare the sizes. Oh wait, it is, it is smaller. It is smaller. Look, 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 look. So it was melting. Now I don't know if that's because of the volcano or if that was over time, but new find. The, the snowball is getting smaller. So smaller over time. Um, let's see. Ducky. And... That doesn't really... Do anything. Okay. So let's grab the duck. Put him in the back of the car. And why not? We'll take the toboggan with us. Um, keep the candy candy cane out here. <clears throat> let's go, let's go. Oh gosh, I know, I hear the alarm for the timer. Nah, I'm going, I'm going. It's only 36 minutes, it's cool. All right, duck, show me what you can do. Actually, with the toboggan, I think you might be able to, um, to use it like a little thing, like an elevator for like yellow wood. <gasps> Ooh, ideas. <gasps> does he float? Does he float? It does not look like he floats. He does not float. Quack. He quacks though. He's a quacker. Okay. Well, shoot. <laughs> Fun little duck, duck bird. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, wait, where is it? There we go. Thank you, everyone, for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Merry Christmas. Thank you for your donations. The people who won the packs, batches, make sure you contact me. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call at the end. It's really your choice in the end. Love you guys very much. Have a great holiday. We'll talk to you very soon. Outro.